grace upon grace greetings and welcome to our 31 days of excellence today is day 19 and we are looking at uh, successful people and successful habits i believe that you are well and welcome once again today we will look at uh, daniel who is a successful and excellent uh, person daniel chapter 6 uh, verse 10 the bible says and now when daniel knew that the writing was signed he went into his house and his windows being opened in his chamber toward jerusalem he knelt upon his knees three times a day and prayed and gave thanks before uh, his god as he did a full time uh, so here we see that successful people do daily what unsuccessful people do occasionally uh, this means that they practice daily disciplines, they implement systems for their personal growth, and they make it a habit to maintain a positive attitude. And this one we're getting from John uh, C. Maxwell. He's a writer, he's a preacher, he's a mentor. And uh, we see that life is the sum total of, uh, success and, uh, of many successful years. A successful year is the sum of uh, many successful months. A successful month is the sum of many successful weeks. Successful weeks is the sum of many successful days. In summary, we can say that successful people have successful habits and unsuccessful people, they don't have successful habits. Uh, David, for example, had habits of praising God on a daily basis. Daniel had habits of praying three times a day. And Jesus had also godly uh, daily habits built since his, uh, his childhood. So did you pray today? That is a question that we are raising today. Did you read your Bible today? Did you attend the morning altar of prayer? Are you working towards your goal today? day what are you doing for you to be successful what are some of the habits that you are working on on a daily basis to ensure that you are successful that is the question that you have to raise to yourself uh, today it's a challenge actually so if not why and how what how are you expecting to succeed in life stop excuses just go read your bible attend on morning out of prayer pray work hard and the last question i'm going to ask you today with that uh, meditation that you have done today what is your prayer today let us go before the lord and put your prayers as we go before the lord to pray father we thank you for the meditation of today lord you are teaching us oh father that successful people have successful habits you've called us to be successful uh to be excellent and not be your mediocre as we pray father that you may give us the grace of oh god to be uh, successful to be excellent oh god to have goals to have habits of oh god that we're going to do on a daily basis to ensure that we are rising the ladder of success in our lives lord we pray father for the same anointing that had a david a daniel and jesus oh god in our lives in the name of jesus christ father give us the grace to work hard give us the grace to set a uh, re uh, reasonable and realistic goals in our lives in the name of jesus christ father as we started the year uh, since january lord we have so many things that we are yearning to do father we pray for the grace to work hard to be successful in the name of jesus amen Wow, thank you so much for joining me for the morning uh, deal. I encourage you to join us for the morning altar of prayer in the morning from 6 a.m. to 6.30. Purpose to join us from Facebook and YouTube. And I believe that the Lord is going to bless you in an amazing way. Not forgetting uh, for the closing session in the evening uh, from 6 p.m. to 6.30 p.m. And the Kingdom Advancement Prayers are there after uh, as we uh promote the kingdom with the prayers. Have a lovely day and be blessed. Amen.